Good morning, family. Are y'all saying good morning? <laughs> it is nine something in the morning here. What? What? The twins decided to wake up at like 3.30 a.m. this morning. No. No. Yeah, you did. What? What do you want them to know? You just want to smile at them? <laughs> you are so silly. They didn't fall back to sleep until about five. <laughs> the camera is not all about you. Unless you're going to say something. Are you going to say something? You're just not even going to say anything. <laughs> so, Kai, you going to say something? Say hi. Hi. Say love you. That chick angel. That chick angel. Angel. That chick angel. Angel. They woke up at 3 30. Then go back to sleep until 5. And um, so I had to get their brother ready, catch the bus. We caught it this time because yesterday we missed it. So, um, they slept until about 8.30. And then I got up and washed some of the dishes, not all of them. I'll watch the rest later today. I'm fixing them their breakfast, which is their usual eggs. And um, they'll have some turkey sausage crumbo. And they had some muffins and some diluted orange juice. So today, I am hoping to finish cleaning the important areas of the house, which are the formal dining room, the boys' room, and um, the front of my bedroom, which is where we have a bunch of extra stuff. And all I need to do is just really fold up my extra clothes neatly. And just put everything that's on the floor because we don't have a, a like a piece of furniture to put the stuff in. Just fold it up nicely on the floor. The boys' room looks like a hurricane's been through it, so that's gonna take a little more time and care, <clears throat> as well as finish the important stuff for Big Marcus's birthday party. So I'm gonna show y'all what I have left to do in the dining room. Trying to get these eggs up out of this skillet. These fluffy eggs. I've got to put cheese in them, but they don't really care. They just be happy. And I'm going to fix myself some egg whites. So that's their, their eggs. And I'll fix their crumbles in a second. They're hot. Say bye bye, family. <laughs> okay, I'm going to show y'all the dining room in a second. So, you guys, this was supposed to be a pre poo with coconut oil on it, but I still have not washed it. Anyways, what I have done, which makes me very excited, is put up the curtains. Hold on, let me see if I can come. That my sister gave me. Y'all see those? I put them on our front window, so I hung the curtain rod finally. Um, as well as, other than all the toys from the kids, just throwing their Legos everywhere. Um, I pretty much cleared out this room. That's gonna go in the garage. Big Marcus can tell me what he wants me to do with his stuff. Um, so yeah, ooh, I got one other thing I might be able to do before it's time to go pick up my son. Let me see if I can knock that out. Nah, I'm gonna do it. I thought I could hang something, but I'm not gonna be able to. So, I'm just gonna clean up these Legos and go get little Marcus, and then we're gonna run to Target, and not Target, to Walmart to pick up the, these photos I printed to go on my wall, so I'll show you those. They're family photos. And then I'm gonna go to Costco. Oh, thank you, you can put that back. It's a little busy children. I'm gonna go to Costco to order something for the party on Friday, and the dollar store. So. We'll be out and about for a bit. So I want to at least straighten up some so when Big Marcus gets home, it's not a crazy mess. All right. 
Bye. Yo, why did I just realize that I came out of the house looking like this, which is fine. I'm not mad about my twists, but I just remembered that when my hair is in twist, my bald spot is just out there for the world to see. And I was out like this earlier when I dropped my son off at the bus stop. And I meant to grab a hat, but I accidentally left it. I have a hat in my car that I'm gonna end up putting on. Um, it's a winter hat. It's 55 degrees, it'll work. But I just literally realized that I feel bad for the parents who had to see my bald spot earlier. I'm sure they were concerned. Oh well, it's real in these streets. This bus is late, but praise God, I was late too, so. He's later than me, so he'll never know that I was late. All right. Marky, so guys, I am back home, obviously. Um, I just put on um, the new edition mini series. Y'all watching that? My face is so oily from my hair, which I still haven't washed out. Show y'all these pictures real quick, and then show y'all what I've been up to. So. Ooh, I'm greasy. The camera can't even focus. There's so much oil. Okay. So, printed off the picture that's in my insulate. Boom. That was uh, when the babies got christened. Printed off this picture of the boys, which is hysterical. Oh, my, fa my family. My, my um, lens is greasy. Hold on, y'all. Okay. This picture of the babies. And then this picture of my big baby. So I'm going to be putting these pictures along with some other pictures that have already been framed. They're um, pictures from before us having the boys when it was just me, Marcus, little Marcus. But um, I'm going to put them on this wall. A little collage of photos, um, along with, uh, I have this like applique that uh, can go on the wall. It says something about family, I can't even remember. The twins are sitting here on the floor. That's the old curtain that was up, they didn't got into it. Get it, get a new addition. They're killing it. Um, little Marcus is in the kitchen doing his homework. So much brighter than what are you doing? You didn't ask. You need to do your uh, homework first. You have water. You probably even you probably only had water like once today. You haven't had it at all, huh? Yeah, water for the rest of the night. Say hi to the family. Hi, hi, family. <laughs> He's doing his homework. So I've been folding clothes. I want y'all to see. I already did a bunch. How many clean clothes I have to fold. And I have some stuff in the washer and the dryer. Look. <laughs> Massive pile. But I'm about to get on it. Like I said, I already folded a bunch. Do I still have all this wool scully? Oh my goodness. There we go. Yeah, y'all. Was out of the house with this big old ball spot showing. But yeah, I am about to... Huh? You can see my bald spot a little? No, I, no, no, I can't. No, you can't. Um, so, uh, Big Marcus, he left work late and then he went to Lowe's. He will be doing the recess lighting in the living room within the next two days. So, all right. Oh, man, did his shirt fall? I think one of these shirts fell and... This floor in here could be cleaner. All right, let me get to work. So little Marcus is catching some of the new edition movie and he is blown away by Ralph's character using a payphone. <laughs> he was like, how do people used to make calls on those? They're so hard. Yes. He's folding. Folding clothes, folding clothes.
never really seen it before <laughs> because I live in California. Frost is when it gets so cold in the morning that the precipitation or the dew that's on the grass, because you know how uh, sometimes when it's cold in the morning, the grass is kind of wet. So that's dew. So um, in the morning, sometimes it's so cold that the dew freezes and it gets stuck to your window. Growing up in Kentucky, every single morning in the winter time, your window would look like this. Because it's always so cold in the morning. It's not so much the case here in California. But it is only 35 degrees right now. So that's kind of crazy. Okay, 35 degrees. Nobody asked for that in California. The kid asked for all the rain that he can. And I don't know, I think we're done with the rain. I think. So it's, it's probably good that the weather isn't too hot to just evaporate that all up. Um, I see it. Um, these cars are speeding on this road this morning. They've got places to be. Everybody needs to keep their eyes open. Sorry wanted to come in and come by and say good morning to you guys and um I'll talk to you next time. Okay guys hours have passed. I haven't put up the podcast because I have been on a just uh, a roll cleaning the boys room there. The twins are sitting there like two old men with the feet up. I'm putting up family photos. I think I'm supposed to show y'all this. So there's one. I'm about to put up the next one. It's gonna be six total on that wall. Um, so I'm trying to hurry up and do it before I have to go pick up little markers from the bus stop. And then uh, I'm about to curtain rods. But there, wrong. Finish putting up these folded, these clothes that I folded, and then move to putting the podcast up, and then finishing everything for my husband's birthday party. I just found out I have an audition tomorrow. Praise God. It's not until like five something in the evening. So I can more than likely go without them because he should be home. All right. Let me hurry and do this before I pick up my baby. <laughs> Bye. Why are you screaming? Why did move the sick and full play L pimp? What's up, guys? I am on my way to pick up my son, Marcus. I uh, got in a quick shower. Cause I was like, oh, I want to take out these rollers, but I was like, I want to take them out before. I don't want to take them out before I take a shower, cause I don't want the the humidity of the shower, the moisture in the shower to ruin curls. So we'll see how they turned out. Of course, I wanted to take them out on camera the same way I'm doing the video. I don't know if I told y'all we're doing. Uh, I'm doing a hair video with a little special twist to it. And of course I wanted to take these out on camera for the hair video, but that's just not gonna happen. So anyway, um, on my way to get him, the bus usually gets there at around 3.15, but one of these days here, he got there way earlier than that. So I'm hoping that's not the case. Um, Cause I'm really not understanding what time they want us there. Cause getting there at three o'clock is just, I mean, that's what time I tell people to get there who are picking him up for me is three o'clock. Just so, without a shadow of a doubt, they'll be there to get him uh, on time or early. But for me, three o'clock is just, he's never there at three o'clock. Not, not now one time. I remember last year, the time was 3.30. And then of course they didn't get there that late. It's just so, it's LA. Help his father. So anyways, I'm going to run just a couple of errands after I get him and then finish working on folding up the clothes. And oh, get the podcast up, obviously. So the podcast will be up probably around 6 or 7 p.m. my time. Please don't hit me, sir. All right, I'll talk to y'all later. Yes, we're going to get Marcus. Marcus. So cute. All right, guys. Bye. Thank you.
I'm headed up to Kids Land's anniversary where they are just celebrating the store's anniversary and they asked me to come, so here I go. Yay! Okay, this store is dope. They have every single thing you can think of up in here. Um, I probably typically wouldn't have came down here because it's not close to my house. But they honestly have, like the store keeps going that way. And then there's all of this this way. It's amazing. Oh, I'm in people's way. And it's a lot of people here. A lot. I should have wore the twins instead of taking the stroller. But let's see. See if I can find the owner real quick. That's what it is. to a baby store called Kids yeah. Land. They just sell stuff for babies. Um, I ended up not getting to work out and I didn't vlog because... Stop screaming. And what, 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 what? What? Boy, you didn't already tell me that before. Um, I didn't end up vlogging because... I was upset. Oh, sorry. I was upset at a little Mr. Someone because he had been treating one of his friends poorly by hitting them and twisting their arm and pushing their fingers back because he felt like his friend was not listening to him and talking too much. And so... I was very upset, and so I was not in the mood to vlog. But we're better now. And um, apologies have been made. Not all of them have been made yet, but apologies have been made. So I'm in a, bad, a little bit of better mood, a better mood. So let me show y'all. I had to rush out of my house to get to that. Um, kid land. Yeah, kid land. And was in the middle of putting these in my head. Like I was recording it and everything and then just had to stop recording, rush out of the house and do the rest in the car. So this is what my hair is looking like right now, but I'm on my way to an audition. So these have got to come out. And uh, my audition is at 3.30. I do believe it is 3.15. Traffic is horrible. Mm, 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 mm. So I'm praying that parking will be simple. I can run in, run out. It's a commercial audition. I pray that there were no lines I was supposed to memorize. I feel like I'm dressed more like a mom than I am for, the, for just a chick casual, but it is what it is. I had to rush. So, with that being said, I'm gonna take these out and pray that my hair looks okay. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I keep moving them away from the car display because they're trying to pull the whole display down and they are moving, and they were moving the stroller in unison. Stop. 
They don't want me to win. I'm getting my husband a birthday card. I'm looking at this one possibly. Uh, then I've got to get cards. Sorry, I look a mess. I got to get cards from the kids to him. Stop it! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Stop. Oh. I need to give them something that they can destroy a little bit. Here we go. Here, boys. Here. Here, I'll give you one too. There you go. Have fun. There we go. Perfect. Now let me get to my business. They're smaller roses. Um, I got them in white. I probably should have gotten some color, but the white was just so pretty that um, I figured let's just go with um, let's just go with white. I mean, red obviously would have been preferable, but red costs more money. So I'll show y'all here in a second. I bought 50 total, so it'll cost me $20. Um, yeah, they're crazy pretty. Some of you those to decorate the table. Okay guys, so the birthday party is happening. I haven't walked out there yet because I had to get dressed. I got in the red dress that I wanted to wear. Oh, is that the slip hanging? Anyway, it's gonna end up hanging. But anyways, so there is a cellist playing hip hop. Let me show y'all his right. Because I know quitting. <laughs> and then Denora came in here shutting it all down. All the way. All, all the way. down. Get the toe. Uh, turn around, show the back. Show the, show the chain. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is the chain in the back. Yes. Yes. With the legs just as long as anything. Just as long as the, as the sky. I just can't. With the two step. Ah. yourself. Yeah. Yeah. I was just going to hire you to play the cello, but I was like, she might be a little out of practice. <laughs> It's a birthday boy. Yeah. Is that is it with the slow turn? A video. Oh yeah, no, I'm just doing video. It's still cute. The hip hop station. You had a cellist at your birthday party. A cellist in your smoker's jacket. A cellist. I did. <laughs> On stage. <laughs> On stage, right there. Yeah. Boom. In the front of it. All right, everybody. Um, Madison. Madison. Madison, hit that switch. Okay. Okay. He said. All right, everybody. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear Marco! Happy birthday to 
you want cake, I'll cut your cake uh, and enjoy <laughs> yourself. Because uh, Lamar is that what we do. So yes, please enjoy yourselves, mingle, drink, have yourself a good time. The festivities are still going, even though I have nothing else planned. So. <laughs> I know. Y'all, I tried to get a baby no, no. tiger here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, if I can get a baby tiger for $75, don't give me a baby tiger. I don't want to be no tiger. It's going to be a Rottweiler with a dog. You got one of them dogs out there. Rottweiler with a dog. Oh my God. But in case anyone wanted to know, baby tigers or. Tiger Cubs, as they're called, I could get one. are six thousand dollars. <laughs> oh. oh. Shake.